But I'm going to use two setups with two separate kinds of rigs. And uh, hopefully it's going to give me a good read on the water with those blackfish. They're definitely around to what degree, I don't know. We've got green crab. I'm rigged up three-way. And I got a slider rig. And I have the bait reels and two rods. Uh, so I'm going to cover a lot of water. So when I've been fishing for these tog, these tau tog, tall tog, I've been exclusively using green crabs, half of green crabs. And they just work great. At least this year, this time. A lot of bait, a lot of green crab. I'm going to get cutting and uh, we'll see what we get. I'll just cut a bunch at once. And I'll cut them in half. about four or more and when I get started I want to get their legs in the water right in front of me that'll drift out in the tide I'll fish them with legs too but I hope those legs in the water will draw some fish in feels like a good fish Wow, I think he's close. I'll see if we can get him up. I might have to hand line him. Wow, so he took the slider rig. Let's see how big he is. That's eight. He's just short. Just short of 16, he's about 15. We unhook him. Anything bigger, we're gonna have to pull up with our hands. So that's one on the slider rig. The water is still now. It's a really stout, hefty fish. Let's get him on this way. I'll talk about my first rig. My first rig, I have monofilament line, and it's a sliding rig. Three ounces would be fine, but I'm using four. That is a spider hitch. You can use an Albright or a surgeon loop. Then you cut the loop on the end. And uh, I'm using a two-hole hook on this. It's a 30-pound mono. That's a good piece of bait right there. That's for sure. Don't get a bite on that. They're just... Oh, that's a good fish. Crab. Oh, he's a little guy, but he took it. I think we have him. Yeah. Strong hooks. So it's two on the slider. It's, oh, he got it in the mountain. Just kind of twisted around. So I'm liking the slider rig. Right? On the other one, this is a 2 0 hook, too. The other one I have a 4 0 hook on. I'll show you that if we get anything. It's a 2 on the slider. I'm liking that. He felt bigger. This is the second setup. A uh, little different. That's an Albright braid. I'm probably putting on mono. I like the mono though. I'd rather be using mono. That's a 30 pound Berkeley trilene. That's my. It's a surgeon loop that I cut, and this is just a three way rig, four ounce bank sinker, and on here, that's a 4 0 hook, a bigger hook. I'm using on this for bigger crab too. Make sure when you do your three-way rigs, I found, I like to keep that bait slightly lower, slightly lower than the sinker. Um, if I start railing them on one setup over the other, that's what I'm going to use. But uh, right now I'm going to stick the way I'm rigged. Whoa, 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 whoa. So we got one on, he might be the biggest one yet. This is the three-way rig, he's going under. Oh yeah, he's nice. He's not a keeper, but he's definitely a bigger fish. Alright. Maybe he is. 
Wow, he might be up there. I'm gonna measure him. He might be a keeper. My keepers are bigger. I'm looking for a 17 inch fish. He's definitely 16. That's the 4 0 hook. Three way rigging. Let me get a measure on him. It's eight. It's eight. He's right in there. But we're not going to keep him. I put a mark on my rod too. That's 17. I call it 16. I'm looking for one like that. If I'm, if I'm even going to keep it. Get this beautiful blackfish on his way. It's good. That's a keeper. I know that. Okay, buddy. Tell your big brother. We're waiting for him. The talk bait. I use half green crab. You can leave the top shell on. I will take it off. And throw the bottom shell in the water. Lots of guts. Blackfish love that. And it seems to be making a difference. Two different rigs, two different setups. Uh, this one is definitely... I can get hit on that one next. Okay, we got hit good. He's a good fish too. Oh. He looks like he's just short. Whoa. Wow, let's get him over. And there I don't think it matters. They're getting them right down the right down the line. About that 14, 15 inch fish. Beautiful, beautiful fish. I really am enjoying this. They're all over. I don't think it matters where you go. I'm thinking anywhere between six and fifteen feet of water. New structure. We're gonna get this here beautiful blackfish. He's just short, I can tell you that. Probably 14, 15. Get him on his way. Really different day today. Uh, I was out the other day. I was getting them at the end of the cast, uh, kind of slipping the bait through. That was the bottom. Today. I've been getting them right around the pillar, straight down, bigger fish. The other day was smaller fish. Uh, had one nice keeper today. And uh, four fish, missed a few. But a pretty good productive day otherwise. But it just a bite just died off too. The other day, this is when it picked up. That's, uh, I guess that's tog fishing for you. <laughs>